Hello everyone, welcome to Phasmophobia. Today, we're heading into Edgefield on Professional. So last time, we played Nightmare, and I kind of remembered. Nightmare is where I feel like I'm playing the game, I guess. At least that's where it feels like I need to be with learning the ghosts and stuff. But when I go back to Professional, I really just want to have fun and kind of remember you can just do whatever you want almost. Now, I was kind of looking at the difficulties, and on Intermediate, it even said the standard ghost hunting experience, so... I mean, I play on professional, and to me, professional is like the standard mode, but, I mean, I have, no, I have not really gone back to amateur or intermediate, so that's another thing is, I have looked at the weekly, and on the weekly, you only get the one times reward, so it's like amateur, but I will be trying the weekly challenge sometime, and this week I saw it was the primitive challenge, which actually looks kind of fun, so maybe that one will try out before the week's over. But hey, I've been walking around, is there any ghost in here? We do have the locker in the garage, which is a nice hiding spot now. No Ouija board. I kind of don't really remember the cursed item spots here. Let me go walk around upstairs. Oh god, lag spikes. Is anyone here? Maybe I should have my EMF out. Oh, I was going to say, well, this door is open. Okay, I don't... Mm. Maybe I'll take a photo. Okay, three star interaction. Well, now the thing is, sometimes I get a ghost in here, and sometimes it's in this room, sometimes it's actually over there in the bathroom, and the interactions just kind of cross over. So I really need to see where this ghost actually is. Any hiding spots here I could use? Oh, okay, see, I heard this back here now. Okay, so you actually maybe are near this door. Let me, hmm, I don't know where the bone is. Also, the voodoo doll, I believe, could be in here. Wow. I haven't really played Edgefield a lot. I kind of forget there's even a hiding spot right here. Oh. Hmm. See, now I really just want to go get UV. Oh, oh my god. Well, I'll get another photo. I'll get this one. Okay, let me just go ahead and drop my stuff. I'm gonna go get the UV. I'll get a photo for that. I never even turned on the breaker. Alright, AMF. Oh god, look at all those. Maybe you'll get one more free photo. Oh, okay, so much for free photo. Let's delete that. Now, I never even turned on the breaker. So here, I'm gonna use my headlight. We're gonna run down to the basement. Get this breaker turned on, and then we'll go get equipment. But also, while we're down here, there's the bone here. Ah, uh, that's not useful. Yes, here's the breaker. So yeah, I, <clears throat> I guess I kind of forget where some of the cursed item spots are. I don't think I really need it, but let's walk outside. Actually, no. Oh, it is the music box. How did I miss this? Where are the tarot cards in this map? Oh, no, I think the tarot cards just start right here. Okay, well, we know it's the music box, which I need to get a photo of. Uh, and also, I could get a photo of the ghost. Do I need to get a photo? I don't think so this time. Actually, just escape and then paramike again. Well... The UV's probably gone, but I'm just gonna go in there with some evidence. Now, you were kind of out here. I don't really know how much that means you're roaming. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and put that right in. Are you here? Maybe you like this room. Here. I, want, I really want the ghost to start interacting with some other stuff. I'm gonna put that ball here and see if the ghost does something with it. See, was that in this room? Oh, well, it's, this is obviously the colder room. You threw something on here. I'm not going to take a photo. Let me scan with this. Okay, well, it's been a while. I was expecting it to be a little colder than that. It is staying right at 4.7. Photo of the ghost! Oh. <laughs> I'm not going to try and take a photo when he's coming to the door like that. Alright, see, now you're draining my sanity. Are you here? Are you friendly? Activate. Okay. Poltergeist, Phantom, or Mimic. Okay, so I need to look for those. Ghost orbs. Where are you? See, that ghost photo, if it was a phantom, that would have told me something. So, sanity, I'm not sure about. Let's actually just go ahead and walk out the door. Actually, look at that sanity. It's a bit lower than I was expecting. I do have to escape. So maybe we'll get, yeah, the other, uh, let's get two other evidence in there. Then I'll get a smudge just to be safe, I guess. 
but I don't know when this ghost is gonna start hunting. I never even turned on any of these other lights just because I didn't realize I was walking through the house without the breaker even on. I guess with that tier 3 flashlight, it's really easy to see where you're going. Okay, here, there I am, sprinting again. Let me scan in here. Now, if it's a mimic, I'm gonna get ghost orbs immediately. Oh god, that's another... Okay, you really want to drain my sanity now. So, EMF... Four. Jesus, see, this is why I got the smudge. See, okay, I'll put this down in the middle. Oh, my camera. There. Alright, we're getting photos at least. We do have UV, so I can get more photos of that easily. Okay, speaking of which. Where's my glow stick? Oh, it's over here. I don't like going back into the room like this. So there's the fingerprint. And there's the interaction. Okay, let's just try and fill these photos. I hope that one was it. Yeah, it was. Okay, well, let's... Okay, this will be all the photos then, at least. <laughs> I'll watch it change in front of me. Okay, there. All photos taken care of. We didn't get the bone. I'm not worried about a perfect game. You just want to keep touching the doors. What about freezing again? Since we didn't get dots, why you been in here? Wow, okay. Quit touching that door. Maybe it's like EMF 5. Okay, we gotta get writing in here. Okay, this sucks. Oh my god, he actually started hunting right on top of me. Okay, even... I hate my headlight. I really can't tell if I have that on or not. Okay. We made it to the hiding spot. Ooh, okay. See, I actually thought he was hunting. When he first appeared, he was right in the room with me. I thought he was hunting out in the hallway. But hey, at least I got away. I mean, that's the difference between professional and nightmare with that. On professional, you have three seconds before the ghost starts moving. On nightmare, you have two. So even there, I had a bit more time to react. I'm actually glad I didn't get myself killed there. So we know it's normal speed. I don't think it's a mimic because we would have seen those ghost orbs already. Oh, there is that the bone? No? Oh, that's just a weird shadow, I guess. Alright, let me step outside. I want to get the book in there. Did we escape or... I hope that counts. Yeah, I mean, I must have saw me there. So I need to get in there with a paramike. Maybe I'll take two more sanity because we don't need to get hunted again. I'm going to go in there with a paramike, sit there. Maybe we'll get riding. And then also need to see about ghost orbs, which, look, I kind of have my camera set up. It would be nice if we got dots, but can we even get dots? I need, like, a ghost photo here. Well, I mean, if it was Mimic, it would be freezing. And mm, the ghost orbs. Alright, let me just go in there with the writing. Maybe it's... It doesn't seem like a poltergeist. What else can I bring in there? I guess I want another smudge. I guess I'll just bring in these two, since that's the only thing that maybe will happen. Also, I, I, did, I did take two sanity pills, but I don't really know how much that's going to help me. I'm going to put this one out here. Oh, and the bull did get thrown a little bit in that hunt. Give us a sign. Oh, I didn't get the paramic. Well, I still want this last evidence, though. It really does not seem like a poltergeist. And that would be riding. Since I'm looking around. I kind of like just holding the camera like this more. I don't like walking around with it on the tripod. This is a lot easier to look through. Oh god, <laughs> went through the curtains. So I'm not seeing any ghost orbs. I'm going to set this up right here. Hmm. Still all the same fingerprints, but we know it can't be Obake. Oh, there's fingerprints on there too. Man. Can't be EMF5. It would only be Ghost Orbs if it was Mimic. Maybe it is freezing now. Do I even want this? I don't even think I want my light. Where this go? Maybe it is freezing by now. Ah. Okay, this ghost has been in the room long enough. It's not sunrise. So, I don't think it's freezing. 
But why does this always happen? I have a hard time getting this last one. I'm gonna write off freezing, and it definitely doesn't seem like the mimic because there's no ghost orbs either. Maybe it is just writing, but god, this is the worst poltergeist ever. <laughs> Maybe the ghost orbs are somewhere else. Where'd that camera go? I'm gonna take the camera and look around a bit more, because if it's ghost orbs, maybe the mimic is just taking the ghost orbs in different rooms with it. Let's just check the adjacent room. Oh my god, okay, you're following me in here. Maybe it was like a hallway ghost, and you've just been hanging out in there, even though that's the cold room. No, there are no ghost orbs, so unless they're hidden, unless I'm seeing them in here. No, I don't think there's ghost orbs. Okay, I've been in the dark long enough here. I mean, we got the spirit box in the UV. How do... Mm, it would be nice if I could get a picture of the ghost. Now, I can try that with the music box. Okay, I did say I wanted to mess around here. But I, I just... I find it weird that it, sometimes it's hard to get this evidence. Well, what I'm going to want to do then... Somehow I'm going to use this music box. Now, I <laughs> I need to take a photo of the ghost to see if it disappears like a phantom. But I, I'm not going to get the photo in the book, which sucks, because I'm not going to be able to tell that way. So I'm going to have to take a photo of the ghost and see if it disappears right in front of me. So, oh my god, how am I going to do this? Let me make sure, one, I have everything I need. So I could just drop this. I don't know if I'm going to start from the bottom here and walk up the stairs, or if I should start from over here. <laughs> I have no idea what I should do. Do I have a... I guess I don't. Okay. I'm going to start from over here. Oh god, okay, the ghost is over there. And then I'm going to smudge. Let's just see what happens here, because I... Uh, Alright, I'm just going to see what I d can do. Oh my god, you're already walking. And you are a phantom. See, that's what's weird. I kind of know about this hiding spot. Thank you, Insim. Okay, so what happened there kind of was good. He did immediately start walking because I was so close. And I did have enough time to just take him the picture, and guess what? He disappeared, so we know he's a phantom. But what is that last evidence if it's a phantom? Okay, I'm gonna very quickly look. So it's dots? Maybe, how is it not giving me dots if it's phantom? I mean, we know it's a phantom because I just took a photo of it and it disappeared. See, even on professional, sometimes you have to do nightmare level stuff. I forget, this is a cursed hunt. All right, come on, asshole. Let's just get through this. Now, was this a hiding? Oh, I could have just gone in there too. I forgot to even look in here, has a hiding spot. And this is also a spot I kinda didn't look for the bone. <laughs> oh, and there it is. All right, well, there's extra money at least. Okay, so actually, I think I'm good here other than the paramic sound, which kinda sucks. Oh, thanks, dude, you finally give me the dots. How, how did it take that long? The dots have been here so long, you've been walking back and forth. Okay, so the only other thing now is the paramic. Let me run outside, I don't know what that was. I guess it was the book. <laughs> I've never seen that happen before. I'm thank god. I still have my smudge. I was like why is not it let me out the door, but it already slammed it If he comes in here, I will just Smudge and then run upstairs. I love how I'm in these very unconventional hiding spots lately. I Just gotta wait and see if he comes in here Somehow he's not like, even if he just peeked his head in here, he'd see me. And it's a cursed hunt length. I'm getting kind of lucky. He went up the stairs, damn it. He just sounds so close. Please don't kill me. He went up the stairs, though. I think we're good. I think it's over. Oh my god, it's over. Okay, please. Now we're, let me out. So, okay, look. I'm not even going to bother with the paramic. That This game was good enough. I'm going to just get out of here and survive since this ghost wants to kill me. Sometimes I think it is better to just get out of here. And look, I've been worried about this paramic objective the last few games, so... 
again i like to show that you don't always have to get a 100 percent perfect game to get a good money here we did a good job here we survived this ghost so i'm gonna go ahead and just see how much money we made for it okay see another reason why i just kind of wanted to survive here was i i've been dying a lot and i do want to kind of level up here so i like to have a game like that that's a little more concise i guess it was only a 15 minute game but we did end up finding the bone and also doing something with the music box which like is something you need to do in nightmare normally so you know something i forgot about though is the tier three and do we have enough money so that's another reason why i wanted to survive that's a tripod oh it's only 2k okay well i'm gonna get that i thought it was gonna be 5k all right well look i guess maybe next time we will try the other uv because this time we had a uv ghost and i didn't get to try the tier three I still feel like the tier 2 is going to be better, but all right there, we've added that to the loadout. So again, I just wanted to level up here. I didn't want to, I didn't have any other reason to really risk dying. I mean, I could have gone back in there for the one objective, but one objective is not going to make too much of a difference when you can just go back into another game and have another full game. So if you're still here, thank you so much for watching. Remember to like and subscribe and I will see you all next time.